What's up guys, welcome back to another video. If you're new to the channel, please make sure you hit that subscribe button. If you've watched my last video, the M3 actually isn't running very well. And I've been trying to figure out what's going on with the car. And been throwing some parts here and there at it, trying to fix it. it really hasn't got me anywhere. Still really lean on cold start, lean and boost. But what I discovered when I was looking at my fuel pump the other day, I was gonna have my friend rewire it. I noticed that one of the connectors on the OEM harness, it was loose. And let me show you guys. So this one you can kind of see is a lot bigger than this hole. And the reason was is because it was thinking probably heating it up or something and it just wasn't good. So I think that was causing an issue with maybe not getting enough power. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to run this thicker wire from this uh, from the Walbrill uh, lines. I'm going to run them through here. Then what I'm going to do is uh, seal this up with a, a fuel resistant epoxy. And I'm going to ground this to the OEM harness. There's a power wire from the relay. On these Walboro 450 fuel pumps, I guess you have to run a, a relay, otherwise it overpowers and overruns the stock fuel pressure regulator. My buddy mounted it there. And what I'm gonna do, ground that to the seat belt, and then ground the Walboro to the seat belt. We really should be money. And I'm gonna drill out these holes a little bit bigger. The one for the ground, I'm gonna drill out a little bit. Get those, sneak those wires through. Then I'm gonna use this clear, Epoxy to make sure that it doesn't run away. And then I'm going to connect it here with these buck knuckles. So this one was already a little wide open, but you can kind of see that it's bigger than the other hole. DA approval and it fixes the economy. Rationality becomes a standard for the economy. Less bombings and a self decline and boost of poverty. Suddenly the Nobel Peace Prize goes to a rhyme and life bang. going through here and connecting them here so did the power now I'm gonna run the ground so see you in a bit all right so I've been working for a little bit and here's what I got so far so you can see I used 12 gauge wire and wired it to the Walbro fuel pump. Use these butt connectors here, which seal it up. So, see here, I'm gonna epoxy this in here, and then I'm gonna epoxy it out here as well. <laughs> So it's next morning, and here you can see the pump looks pretty strong. It's not going to move. We got that good to go. <clears throat> so I'm going to put this in the car now. I got the pump in. 
and a little fuel there. Now I just need to tighten this up a little bit. So what I'm going to do is use this flat end and then just hit it with a hammer and you should be good. But I'm going to wipe up that fuel real quick. Alright, so got that screwed on. So I'm going to put these hoses on there now. So far I've wired the power and now I'm going to wear the ground to the seat belt and then I'm going to ground this ground wire to the seat belt as well. The screen wire I'm going to run to this trigger wire to the relay in the back and then I'm going to wire everything in the back and then we should be good to go. I've been so busy today, got this wired up. Started the car, seems to run fine. I haven't driven it yet. Let's see how it runs. Make sure everything's good. I got a new O2 sensor, so let me install that real quick. Alright, so I'm going to install this, and I'll start the car. Eternity later. Alright, so I ended up driving the car, and it ended up driving like shit. I actually got a check engine light for the O2 sensor, so I swapped it back out with my old one. I don't know if really my O2 sensor was bad, but I just picked one up. I thought it but I bought it off Amazon, so probably not a good idea. So let's see if the idle's uh, check engine light is still on. strange all right let me drive it again to see doesn't run good still gotta figure it out I'm gonna call it a night come back at it tomorrow and see if there's anything else I can do we'll figure it out get it running right take it to the dyno figure out what's going on with it appreciate you guys watching the video please like comment subscribe if you haven't already this trick can be a bitch to walk up. Flock of flames, motherfucker, duck the aim. Suckers succumb and they're sucking up for fame. Goddamn, that shit lame. All my independence.